Hello everyone, my name's Jennifer Squires and here we make paint, create, sew and have fun. Today we're doing the December layout for my bullet journal. I've decided to stick to a light floral leafy theme as it is late spring here in New Zealand. I've really found bullet journaling to be quite helpful as it is also it's keeping me on task and seeing everything written in front of me of what I need to do and when I need to do it but it's also satisfying that creative outlet at the same time and I tried using pre-made planners from stationery stores and they never seem to work right or fit with my kind of lifestyle or the way I like to organize myself and so I found bullet journaling I can customize week to week month to month everything to suit my needs and I can change things as I change or if I find something doesn't work for me I don't have to do it again the next month or the next week so it's really really help me keep on task and satisfy that creative outlet at the same time. And with that, my cover page for the month is done. Moving on, I'm going to be doing my month at a glance page, which is just pretty much drawing out the calendar month. And I'll doodle little you know, notes or little pictures to remind me of what's on each day. But mostly I use it to just off the days just to let myself know where I'm up to on the next page I have my habits tracker page which is something I've seen a lot in other bullet journaling videos the three things I'm keeping a track of is I want to exercise every day and I have a habit tracker for tarot cards I want to learn more about the definition of the cards or even maybe start painting a new set and the third habit is to make sure I produce film edit and upload at least five YouTube videos a month
moving on to my week at a glance or days at a glance I honestly thought I was recording when I painted in these flowers but apparently not but you get to see me paint in these beautiful bright green leaf for the layout for my week or days at a glance I've gone with what's called Dutch doors which is when the pages where your day to day is is cut slightly shorter so that you don't have to paint or decorate every single page you can still have you know a beautiful spread without having to paint in or decorate many many pages For my week at a glance, I've cut these squares for each day of the week. So I've got one from Monday through to Sunday with an extra one for little notes that may pertain to that particular week. I'm just sticking these in with a glue stick. complete and it's time for the flip through i hope you enjoyed this video i plan on doing these kinds of videos a little bit more and we will see you next time please make sure to like this video comment subscribe thumbs up thumbs down you do you do all the things to please our algorithm overlords and we'll see you next time